Hello guys and welcome to Geeker Shaves. Um, so last time I did a video I bought the uh, Sensor XL and uh, found out that it comes not only with the two blades but also a three bladed razor. So pretty sure everyone knew what was coming. It's time to do the three bladed razor. So there's the two blade, it's coming off. And this time I'm going to put it the right way up. And we have the three blade, although there we go. So we have the three bladed razor. Now, if we look at it, we have the micro fins for pulling and stretching the skin. We've got your aloe vera strip. Can I get it on the camera? They're spot welded blades. And on the back, let's have a look again. There you go, they're spring loaded. And as you can see, you can see through it pretty well, which means it's likely to clear very well. So, hoping for good things. Let's see how we get on. There's a nice range of motion. Let's give this a go, shall we? As you can hear, running a bit low on my shaving cream. There we go. So, again, I was asked to review this razor um, by several of the viewers. It's an oldie but goodie, as they refer to it. Um, it got pushed down by Gillette quite a lot when Mac 3 came out because they had all the new patents for that. But let's see how we get on with this one, shall we? So, show you in the camera, Chris. Show you in the camera. So that's gone pretty well so far. Trying to really load it up. There we go. So that's pretty loaded. Quick swish. Oh look, it's all clear. It's cutting them well. There's very little tug. So, did have a lot of people saying after the last video, the three blade is not gonna be so good. And to be honest, I sort of was believing them because the two blade was good. Need a little bit more cream. Um, but do you know what? Not going into it with any preconceptions. It's shaving good. Makes me wonder why all these years I was always shaving with a Mac 3. And I think the answer is, uh, as Tony over at Media Mart says, sucker for marketing. Yeah, looks like I have and most of the world. This is a good shave. The two blade is a good shave. It's got a nice rubbery grip. It's not moving, it's not. Might be that as I've got older, I've learned to stop pushing so hard with the head. The Mac 3 does have quite a large range of motion on its head. A bit more motion than this, if you think about it. This one pivots that amount, 
whereas it's a big floppy head on the Mac 3. Funny, it's a pretty floppy head on the uh, Fusion as well. I think it's taken a little bit longer than I thought it would to get the really smooth shave. And I've had to lube up once. Still gets in under the blood under the nose easily because it's only a small cartridge and we're done nice short quick video and dry off there we have it so we have the sensor 3 it does what it says on the tin oh I forgot to check the loop strip didn't I Look, yeah, it's not very looby. It feels okay when you're here, but not. It's not as as goopy as many of them. Actually, that's a positive in some way. Some of them are a little bit too goopy. So anyway, so. There we go. Hope you enjoyed that, guys. Uh, yeah, it's a good razor. Why did we ever have to get more and more complicated razors? I don't know. So, hope you enjoyed it. And um, if you did, please subscribe. Please like the normal sort of YouTubey stuff. But do remember to like shaving. <laughs>